All right, hello again. I've pulled up on my phone here the uh, the current tournament for worst fandom that I looked at that are that I mentioned last video. Uh, yeah, right now we're in the semifinals. It's between Genshin Impact, deserved. Dream SMP, deserved. Voltron, I don't know about Voltron, and K-pop, fucking deserved. You know, I I really think Dream SMP is gonna take it. Maybe Genshin will. I don't know. I don't know enough about the Voltron or K-Bot fandoms to say too much on them, but I know that Genshin and Dream SMP absolutely deserve to be there. I'm surprised Undertale got knocked out by Voltron. I don't know, maybe it's just the fucking Dark Horse I don't know enough about. Yeah, Dankenrampa's on there, Steam Universe is on there, Homestuck. You know, I feel like <laughs> the internet at this point has forgiven the Homestuck fandom entirely because Toby Fox exists. <laughs> But then again, Toby Fox, you know, great as, of a guy as he is, did still manage to give us the absolute most ridiculous fandom. So much of it centered around one specific character who is currently on my screen, disgustingly, you know? I think that's almost impressive that he could be such a great guy and yet somehow very directly involved in two of the worst fandoms on the internet. You know, it's almost, it's almost inspiring, you know? That's the way the internet is. Doesn't matter how good of a person you are. The internet will find a way to make your shit terrible. And even then, it's not like all of the Undertale fandom is like Satan or anything. Like, there's good people in the fandom. I'm just not a part of it anymore because of the people that aren't a good people in the fandom. Aren't a good people. Wow, nice. Nice job, me. Oh dear. Oh goodness, me. Uh, I am still going for my no-hit run, by the way. I think this might be the furthest I've made it on my no-hit attempts. Which is odd, because before I was like, oh, the commentary, it's fucking me up. Nah. Now here I am, chilling. Max health. A very good chunk through phase one, having just been casually talking this entire run. So that's pretty cool. Now I'm not sure. I'm like, is it helping? Am I like miraculously better right now? Because I'm just not. Oh, fuck! Well, there you have it. <laughs> the answer is no. I was thinking in my house, like, oh, is it magically helping me somehow? Am I getting better because I'm just not fully thinking about the game? The answer? Maybe. I don't know. But it wasn't good enough to get a no-hit, so it doesn't matter. Yippee! You know, maybe I can make it so that was the only time that I get hit this run. I have a video that's coming out in a few days since I'm pre-recording these that's a no-healing run where I get through it with just one health bar. Maybe I can do that again. You know, let's show my, my growth and skill and power and triumph. Because I'm so strong. The best. And this time I'll do it while actually giving commentary. Honestly, this is the most I've thought about the actual fight in a while. Genuinely. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, that's one HP lost. Because I don't, I don't... I really... I just stopped thinking about it after, like, the third or fourth episode. And I would just talk about whatever. And now I'm actually, like, looking at the game and being like, hmm, yes. I can get a no-hit run if I focus. Focusing is not what I'm good at. And I really shouldn't be trying to do it while I'm still a little sick. But, you know, here I am. I, I do feel like a certain amount of whether or not I'll get the run or not depends on good RNG for shit like the health taxes. But at the same time, I feel like... Oh god. I feel like I can just brute force it. Just, I mean, doing this once a day, every day. Once I get good enough that I can do a consistent no-hit run except for the health taxes, it'll just be a matter of just kind of banging my head against that wall until I get a run where I'm not forced to pay any health tax. Which I don't know how possible that is, but it's something to think about. Again, it looks like this is going to be a no-heal run, you know. Just the one base health bar. Which, that's pretty cool. I mean, that in itself shows progress, you know. I can do that multiple times. Yeah, this is it. It's 
long as I don't fuck it up here. To be clear, if I do fuck up a, uh, a run and I die somehow, then I will have to record another fight for that day. Like, the episode just gets longer at that point. So, I, I do have a, a certain incentive to actually try and stay alive. I mean, I guess I could try and get long enough to run mid-roll ads, but, you know, that's something to worry about later. Goodbye, subscribe!